Hey guys, this is Henry from Obedient PC Audio Labs. Once again, we're back with our Pro Tools tutorials. Okay, so today we're going to keep working on our Pro Tools edit tools. And today's edit tool is going to be the selector tool. Selector tool is located right in the middle of your edit tools um, bar or group of edit tools right in the middle. There it is, selector tool. Uh, next to the trim or in between the trim and the grabber tool, there's your selector tool. So what or when should you use the selector tool? Well, as the name says, the selector tool is going to let you select areas of your clips, whether they are audio or MIDI clips, doesn't matter. You can select an area of your clip in order to delete it, copy it, paste it. And that's pretty much it. That's what the selector tool does. So let's go ahead and click on it to select it. As you can see, it's set to it's blue, which means that it is activated. It's it's engaged. It's selected. Okay, so you are using the selector tool. So what do you do? It's very simple. You simply go ahead and click and drag to select an area. When you release the mouse, you can you can see it's still selected, right? So one thing you can do once it's selected, you can delete. Sim simply by pressing delete on your keyboard. That's one thing that you can do once you've selected something. You can also copy. Okay, you can copy that selection. Uh, you can do that by pressing Command C on a Mac or Control C on a PC. So we're going to do that to copy. We just copy that. Or you can simply go edit and then copy. Okay, and then once something's copied, you can go somewhere else in the timeline on that track or really any track of that type. And if you simply click and drag, to select an area, then you can paste whatever you had copied there. You can paste by um, pressing uh, Command and then V on a Mac or Control V on a PC, V as victory, or you can simply do edit and then paste. And we just pasted what we had copied before. Very simple. That's it. That's what you typically do with your selector tool. And we're done for this time. So uh, just to recap, we've talked about the zoom toggle, the zoomer tool, the trim tool, and the selector tool. Stay tuned because we're gonna um, we're gonna keep working on these edit tools uh, in this series of tutorials. If you have any other questions, please call us from Obedient PC Audio Labs and we will be happy to help you. We will see you guys soon. Bye bye. Want to learn how to produce music using this or using that or using all of these? Have you been watching videos, reading manuals, blogs, and trying to figure out everything that it takes to be a music producer? Do you have a bunch of music gear that you purchased and you still haven't made any music? Well then you need Obedia, the world's only one-on-one -on -one digital audio training and tech support service. Check out the link below for a special new subscriber offer.